day after he was stabbed in Midtown Sacramento. French train hero Spencer Stone is now awake, able to get out of bed, and in good spirits, hospital officials say. But his attackers are still on the loose. KCRA 3's David Beenick is live at Sacramento Police Headquarters, where police have just given reporters an update on this case. David? Edie, good evening. The police say after Spencer Stone got out of surgery, they were able to question him about this attack. However, the investigators so far have not been able to release any names for the suspects and just the vaguest of descriptions. Sacramento police detectives returned to the scene this afternoon near where Spencer Stone was stabbed during a street fight early yesterday morning. They now say a 24-year-old woman who was with Stone and three other people and who can be seen on the surveillance video during the fight was also treated at the hospital for some minor scrapes. However, still no sign of the two suspects, two men wearing white t-shirts and jeans, who, after the attack, fled along with a woman into the back of a dark-colored Toyota Camry that took off downtown. K Street. We're hopeful, um, but we also realize that it's going to take the community help. And it's going to take that one piece of information uh, that, that comes from um, a witness tip, uh, a friend of a friend that heard something. Police have said the fight started at a nearby bar, but have not specified which one. Today, the owner of the closest bar, Badlands, told KCRA 3 his workers did not see any fight inside or outside that night. Badlands owner says his business and others have turned over video from several high quality surveillance cameras that would likely have captured recognizable facial images of anyone passing by the front door. Meanwhile, the Midtown Business Association today announced it's trying to raise up to $7,000 for a reward to help with the investigation. The attention has really been on this one. It's, it's been a big deal for our community. We want to make sure that we respond and take it very seriously. In the video, Spencer Stone can be seen swinging several punches and knocking one of the men to the ground. However, police say he is considered purely a victim in this case and will not face any charges. Live in Sacramento, David Beattie, KCRA 3 News. David, thank you.